Alright yo, what's up YouTube? Right now you're listening to Mikael aka Mazaku Kami aka Kalekel's Kami and today I'm going to be giving y'all my exclusive top 5 anime list. Now let's start with number 5. Number 5. Samurai 7. One of the greatest anime you, you'll ever see. It's based on like a, a, a samurai genre that is actually based on the movie. Like, and it's so good, it's 26 episodes, you know, it's not that long, it has a great story plot, it has great samurai, great character development. I'm not, I don't really remember how the score was that much, but I know it, it was a good score. You know, I didn't have no complaints when I was watching it. It's a great anime, I recommend you see this anime if you haven't. Please go see it, go buy it off of Amazon, it's probably cheap on there, I don't know. But it's a great anime, I really recommend you watch it. Okay. Now, number four, Kenichi. Now, for the people, anime fans out there who likes action anime, please get this. Please get this. Cut this video off. Go to the store, Amazon, whatever, online. Please get this. It has great action, and the, the, the character development is one of the best you ever see in any other anime. It starts off like with Kenichi. He's actually a wimp at first, but, you know, he gets trained by these, like, Four or five great sages, you know, they make him to a, war a warrior. You no, know, next thing you know, he's getting like he's wanted by a group called Ragnarok, called I think it's the Great Eight Fists, something like that. And they all come at them one by one, something like that. Yes, he is. That's what happens. They all, they all come after him. You no, know, he has to fight him. You know, the more he fights, the more he advances. Like so, you know, all the way up to the first fist. That was a great fight, by the way. I recommend you, you please get this anime. Uh, I don't know if it's cheap online, but you know I, I recommend that you wait till the price goes down. That's the best thing, best way to do it. I get this anime a nine out of ten. This is a great a great anime. And let's get to number three, Four Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. I shouldn't even need to explain. A lot of you know this is a great anime. Great character development, great story, build suspense like crazy. This is a great anime. I really recommend you get this one. I really recommend you get this. Oh man, it's a lot to talk about. I can't really talk about it much. You haven't seen it. I don't want to spoil you stuff for you. But you know, it's about you know this boy and his brother. They know alchemy. You know, they try to, like, use it to bring their mother back who has recently passed. Something goes horribly wrong. And then they're, they're on this journey of trying to, you know, get their bodies back because, you know, kind of, like, messed up their arms. And actually, one of his brothers, his body is completely gone. He's kind of, like, in a hard shell now. Like an armor, like a knight-type body thing. So, like, they're basically on a journey to uh, to get their bodies back. It's it's a really good anime. I can't really explain much. I really don't want to spoil it for you guys. It's a great anime. I still recommend you get this. Now let's move on to number two. Naruto and Naruto Shippuden. Wow. Wow. Great anime. One of my favorite animes. First off, the score, the music in this anime. You, you're not going to find one better than this. You're not going to find this score in any anime better than the Naruto's. That's the first thing. The action is great. The animation is great. The story is, like, the story plot, I love the story plot. It's the, it's the best story plot in any anime I've ever seen in my life. Well, besides, maybe for the Alchemist, I guess it can compete with that. I could say they at par with each other. It's a great anime. You know, Spider-Boy named Naruto Uzumaki. He's basically like the worst student in his class. You know, trying to like to fight. You know, people you know his train gets stronger. So he won't be belittled anymore by his village. Because he wants to become the whole Kage, which is the leader of your village. So like he's trying to get everyone to acknowledge him. And he's doing a great job of doing that right now. He's in the war right now. All the way up to like to the manga. I'm sorry if I spoiled it for you guys. My fact, yeah, S no, S I think it's in the show too. He's in the war in the show. He's doing a great job in the war. You know, he's, he's he's making new friends. He made a lot of new friends. You know, has new techniques that are 
Hokage level techniques. Like he's he's very exceptional ninja right now. I can honestly say he's the strongest ninja in the ninja world right now. I, I really don't see nobody that's stronger than Naruto right now. They may be smarter, but not stronger. So that's a great development for him. Now let's move on to the grand finale. Number one. You should already know. Dragon Ball Z. I shouldn't really have to explain myself. I mean, the music is great. And yes, when I say Dragon Ball Z, I'm killing Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball Z. I, right now, I am excluding GT. I hated that. Oh, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not even going to get into that. Maybe I'll do that for another video some other time. But not now. Right now I'm talking about the favorite list. And GT is not one of them. Anyway, Dragon Ball is more of an adventure. Yeah, as you know, it's, it's an adventure action. It shows how a young boy named Goku, like, you know, develops, learns about the Dragon Balls. Learns about their history. You know, and, like, other people are also looking for him for the Dragon Balls. But, you know, they had bad motives, so he's basically standing in their way. It's kind of like the simple good versus evil genre. You know, this was, like, created in 1984, so, you know, this kind of was the thing back then in anime. And it leads all the way up to Dragon Ball Z, where he's, like, a, a fully grown man. He's learning about his past, like, his race, where he came from. You know, going, you know, fighting people, such as Frieza. One of the main villains is Frieza. I guess one of the minor, not really minor, but, you know, he's not really no more... You know, what's Vegeta, what's the same saga for the first season. They do have seasons for Dragon Ball Z. It's nine seasons. They're very cheap online. Amazon.com. You can get those. Uh, I'm not really, uh, you know, hyped about the, uh, I wasn't hyped for the, uh, season finale. I thought it could have been better. But other than that, in the Garlic Jr. saga, which was a terrible saga, only lasts about, what, ten episodes? You can skip that if you get the seasons. If you want to, nobody would blame you. Nobody would blame you. But other than those two, I get this anime a 10 out of 10. This is a great anime. I recommend you get this. One of the best animes you have, you'll ever see in your life. It's, it's my personal favorite. I like it. I love this anime. Anyway, that has been my top 5 anime list. This has been Mikkel, a.k.a. Mazaku Kami, a.k.a. Kelikos Kami. And thank you, and goodbye. And make sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. Please subscribe. Please comment. I like to know your thoughts. You know my videos. You know you like them, you dislike them. Give it a thumbs up. Give it a thumbs down. I'm happy you're giving your opinion anyways. And thank you for watching this video.